All right, in this video, this is part two for KOWP for beginners. And this is assuming you downloaded the app, but maybe you're having trouble uh, getting the wallpaper to show from KOWP. Um, there are a few things you need to do. Uh, and we're gonna look at all these things here. So maybe you're familiar, or maybe you already know to change your launcher, but let's set up our launcher so KOWP will work. And right now, um, my launcher is TouchWiz Home. So I actually need to go ahead and change my launcher. Now I can do that on my Samsung phone by just pressing the home button because of the way I have it set up. But you can always go to your apps, find the uh, particular launcher that you have. I'm using Nova. And now notice it did change. So that's one thing we want to do. Another thing too is this. Um, right now, I'm, okay, the way I did that is I just held down on the home screen. I'm in Nova Launcher. And I see one, two, and then I got a plus. So right now I got two screens set up. And I'm gonna leave it like that for right now. Um, okay, I'll tell you what, let me go ahead and make Nova always. Okay. So that's one thing we need to do. Now, inside of KLWP, go ahead and open your KLWP app, however you open that. And I already have, this is, we're going to explore some pre-built presets. Um, now, this is just one that I had. This is one that I've made on my own. But as I'm scrolling inside of KLWP, this is screen number one. This is screen number two. So uh, just let me save this. And anytime, the first time you save, and this is the first time you've used custom, it's going to say custom is not currently set up as your live wallpaper. Do you want to set it up? Click OK and we can just click set as wallpaper so now it should be good now remember what i said so right now you see nothing i had a black one and then i had this one here so these are my two screens and notice if i scroll this way it's not going anywhere if i hold down on my home screen again remember we have two screens here one two and i can add more if i'd like and this is what i want to talk about so we're going to explore some presets and we're going to match the screens so let me go back into KLWP. All right, so here's my two screens. Now let's look at the pre-built preset. So up here in the top left-hand corner, tap that little three bar thing. And let's go to load preset. And under installed, let's look for base pack. This is included with the KLWP app. So tap on that. And the one I want to use here is bunch of text. Um, notice it says a scrolling template showing date, time, and weather on five screens. So I'm going to load that up. And remember, I only have two screens right now. So there's one, there's two. But it, the description mentioned five. So notice it looks kind of jumbled up. And here's why. We need to change this to match the number of screens. Okay. Now, all this other stuff, I'm gonna cover all of this stuff here, this stuff down here. All I want to do right now is explore some presets and make sure the screens match up. So now, I'm on screen three of five, I'm on screen two of five, one of five. So notice as I scroll, this number is changing up here and it looks like it should, it's not jumbled up. Notice it's got some fading, the, the things are scrolling, all this, you're gonna learn all this in this series of videos. So um, let's just take it one step at a time, right? Now let's save this. Now that we've already allowed KLWP, or maybe you haven't yet, but remember, make it your, uh, allow it to be your custom live wallpaper or allow it to be your wallpaper. But since I've already done that, I'm saving. And now if I go back to the home screen, it looks jumbled up. And here's why. This is what I'm talking about by matching the screens. I chose five screens in the KLWP app. Now I have to add, how many did I say I had at the beginning? I have one two so I need to add a third one I need to come and add a fourth one and I need to come and add a fifth one now it still doesn't look right you know it is scrolling through five screens there's one two three four five it still doesn't look right does it well what you have to do if it doesn't look right if you reload up KLWP I'm just going to resave it again and I'm going to go back to my home screen and now everything should be good so I'm on screen five screen four, screen three, screen two, screen one, and then I can't go any further that way. So one, two, three, four, five, I can't go any more that way. So that's what I meant here. We looked at one pre-built preset and we're matching the screens. Now, through time, you probably, I, I don't know, like me for example, I, I only use two screens because I've, I've gotten used to using some of the formulas, but that is all gonna come later. 
Um, I just wanted to go ahead and show you if you've got somebody's preset that they shared with you or if you've downloaded one off the Play Store, make sure your screens match up inside of your launcher and actually inside of the KLWP app. And i tell you while I have you here, let's go ahead and load one more preset and see what we have. So I'm going to go back to the base pack. And let's see here. Are any, did any of these other ones tell us how many screens? Template with an uh, S. Tell you what, I'm just going to tap one. Let's do the blur clock. All right. So I'm scrolling. Yeah, this has got some screens to it. So one, two, three, four, five. That's five. What happens if we change this? Let's change it to three and see what it looks like. All right, here's one. That's one there. Two, three. I don't know if you noticed, but the clock does kind of work different there with three screens versus five. And I think this is actually a three screen setup because look, that one there and that one there, it, it, what it is is the clock kind of moved there and then it, you know, it's moving and then it moves a little bit more. So there's screen two screen three, screen four, and now it's going to slide a little bit more for screen five. But honestly, I think if we just set this to three, there's one, you know, the clock goes right to where it needs to be. There's screen two, there's screen three. That looks good right there. So let's save that, apply it. Now remember, this is going to still look like, see it's still got that little, the clock's still moving multiple times, like it's going to move once, and then it's going to move again. So what I need to do here, I need to take away some of my screens. So I don't want to add one. I want to throw this one away. So I'm down to four. I'm down to three. I'm going to press back on home. And now it might work good right off the bat. See, this one did work good right off the bat. Oh, does it? Mm, maybe, maybe not. If you're unsure, what can you do? Open up KLWP. But I do have my screens matching. I have three in here. And I just uh, deleted two to have three on my launcher screen. So this is probably screen one, their screen two, their screen three. But there you have it. We looked at some pre-built presets and we're making sure our screens match up. Now that you've got this uh, figured out, you're actually ready to start making your own custom live wallpaper. But um, this is just the intro piece, getting everything matched up. And that is it for this video. Hope it helped.